Hey lads, this is day 198 of my series to get to 2k on chess.com and we're currently rated the highest rating that we've ever been on this account. We're at 1727 and the opponents are getting harder and harder. I just need to stay more focused. If my mind can focus and I can see the board well and I can be really attentive during the game, I know I can do well and I can win. I just, uh, I know at times I just play a chess and I'm not, I'm not fully there. So I'm hoping when I play today, I can be fully focused. Let's see who we're playing today. A 1728 from Montenegro. And we will play a Jabava. We are essentially the same elo here. Is his bishop coming out? If his bishop comes out, then I will happily play the pawn storm. We'll see what he does. He doesn't go for it, so I will put my knight here. And this is very interesting. He's playing a very slow setup. Um, very slow. I think I'll put the bishop here. And we'll prepare this pawn push. Okay, I am going to kick him. If he wants to trade, that's fine. Okay, and I'm going to go fully in for this. This was a mistake to go back. Okay, and now this pawn is on this square, and I'm going to target it. This looks very good for me. So his king has to move up to protect it? That does not look good for him. Okay, I know my position is winning. I know this is a good position. Check here, he's forced to take. I'm not entirely sure yet. I could go here and threaten the pawn. How does he defend it? I actually think this looks like a good move. He does have a fork though. If I go here and he forks, I come in with a check. He's going to one of these two squares. Let's say he goes here. Yeah, I'm probably not. This is probably a, this is probably a blunder then. Um, I could also push, take. Not entirely sure. I could also um, castle, castle long here, but I feel like I should be more active. I'm thinking this is a good move. He's going to take me. Maybe I take with pawn. And then I have two attackers on this square. Check. He takes. Capture with pawn. Hitting his knight. Maybe he would take my queen then. Oh no, he couldn't take my queen. The pawn's here. Um, So take with pawn. I know this position's good. I just don't know what the right move is. I I feel like this is the move, but maybe we castle first. I don't think castling is wrong here. But if I castle, does he have this move? Getting a tempo on my queen. He might. I don't want him to tempo my queen. And this would allow. This would allow, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with this. I think if if I allow this move, then then it's no good. Now I could take with bishop, but I'm gonna take with pawn. And this has two attackers here. And this knight, if it goes here, I mean that that's looking very good. But I do think I went a pawn here. Oh, interesting. This is very interesting. I was just going to recap. I was just going to capture here, but now I'm thinking about this move. Check. 
If he ticks, we come in here with a check, which looks very good. If he doesn't take, let's say he pushes up, then we check here, and if he goes back, then we just take the pawn. Yeah, okay. So is this better, or is it better to just tick here with check? Might be better to just go up a pawn. But check if the king comes forwards, which is probably his best move. Check. He can't go to these squares. He can't stay on these ones, and he can't stay where he is. So he's forced back to here. Or he could block. I think I'm going to take here. That was a long decision to, to take that. It just seems better just to go up a pawn. But I may have had something there. And I'm going to long castle here so that I'm on the open file. And now let's go here so that we can reroute to here. And I need to move a wee bit quicker. His um, pieces are in a shamble. You know, just total mess there. Let's double our rooks. Play back to here. Probably play this move. This makes total sense. I, I could also play this move. Just push up and then get my bishop into the game. But this and then here would allow his rook into the game, which looks really good for him. Um, not entirely sure. So let's... This one here, here... Seems okay for me. I want to play this move, but if I do, I'm, I don't want to take. If he takes me, I'll be very happy. leave this here because whoever whoever takes is doing worse there and I think I'll play this move my bishop's not good yet But now maybe it, it's okay. Okay, here. And then play for this. Because coming here, yeah, kind of. But here, maybe this is right. Here. Because I hold this. I'm going to take with the bishop. It makes my bishop more active, I think.
Okay. If he comes here, we, we take a check. He thought I was going to recapture there, maybe. And now we take, I think. Or do we take here? No, we take here, yeah. Here, though, he comes here. And then take here. Yeah, maybe we might win a piece. He's definitely coming here, isn't he? And maybe he's going to go there. Okay, yeah, yeah. Um, that makes a lot of sense. He's not in an easy position here. Maybe this rook's going to get a bit more active, but then we go here, you know. So I think we're doing fine. And we can come here and go for this one. Actually, this might have been a better move. Do we protect this? I don't think... No, we can't. I think we, if he takes, we take here. That's that's what we do. Now we're threatening this. So he has to move over. Yeah, I think I'm fine. He still has to move over. And then here. Could also go here. Could also go here. Let's try this move. Keeping his king on the back rank. I want to go here, get my pawns together, if I can. This is intense, lads. Coming here is fine. So we take this pawn. Okay, check. He takes. We take. Or do we go here and then here? I think this move looks a little better because this is threatening checkmate. No! How did I. No! Oh, that was the complete wrong move! Dang it!
Oh, that's so bad. It's actually so bad. <sighs> My goodness. Completely winning again, lads. Completely winning, and I throw it. It's really bad. This is stalemate, if we can get that, but I don't think we're going to get it. Okay, well, we got a stalemate. I, I, that is bad. That is so bad. <sighs> I'm very frustrated with myself there. Okay, we didn't gain any, any points. We didn't lose any points. I guess a stalemate's okay, but like... That's that's not good. I should not be drawing that game. We played with a 73.2. They had a 74.3. We were completely winning the entire game. Like, if you look at that graph, white is just ahead the entire game. All I have to do here, when he did this move, it wasn't even a blunder. I just have to block with a rook. I thought I had to move the king for some reason. Why did I think that? All I do is block with the rook. How did I miss that? Oh, that is so bad. That is so bad. Sometimes, lads, you're just, you're not in it, you know? You're not in it. That is so bad. That's such a simple move. Oh, I can't believe that. Moving in with the knight was the best move, which I'm very happy to see. Taking with the pawn was the best move. We took a lot of time thinking about these moves, and actually going with the pawn forwards was better. Moving in with the queen check just to go up a pawn was not the idea. So here... Uh, if he takes e6, I thought we have g6, checking the king, but then I saw he had this knight move, and that worried me a wee bit. But it says here we can just go e4, and he's probably going to take that, isn't he? If he does, we have knight takes e4, and we're attacking this twice, and his king's just in the middle in the open. Maybe I should have gone for this line, because it does look very interesting. Um, but... We didn't. We just decided to go up a pawn. This whole end game as well, it wants me to push this pawn. Because that allows us to maneuver on the 7th. Having the pawn there al allows me to get both the rooks on the 7th. Maybe that's what we should have gone for. I didn't know about pushing this pawn, but it seemed like an okay move. So I just went for it. Because I could activate my king. But activating my king is what caused me to fail in the end. Blocking with a rook. Such a simple move. And I missed it. Sorry, lads, we should have beaten this guy. We should be in the 1730s, but we're not. We're still 1727. Oh, well, it is what it is. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.